Here's the truth. 80% of you are still choking, squeezing, pushing, and have instability problems when you sing high notes, especially when you try to bridge and connect from your chest voice to your head voice through the vocal break. Now, for men, that bridge position tends to happen around E flat four. For women, it's about five notes higher, give or take, and it happens around B flat four. But you're always going to be frustrated with this process if you don't learn how to fix it. And here's the reasons why. You might feel lost about what to do. You can go out to YouTube videos, but you realize that there's so much content and noise out there on YouTube, it's not adding up. It's just adding to your confusion. Most of you don't have the files, the video demonstrations, the training workouts, the actual facilities that you need to practice and, and train every day. And even if you did, you don't really have a way of knowing that you're doing it correctly. You're stuck in debilitating myths like some people are born to sing and others are not or the terms falsetto and head voice mean the same thing. These points of confusion are creating problems for you. It's adding to your feeling of being lost. You're chasing ghosts. You don't have access to a mobile friendly, easy to use training user interface. These days, you need a platform and technology that will enable you to train on your smartphone, on your tablet, on your laptop, anywhere you can go. But that's not the end of the problem. It can actually get worse. The problems begin to compound. Even if you are currently training, you know that some feelings that you're having inside your voice when you're training and working out, these feelings of little tiny muscle contractions and resistance, they're confusing. You don't know if those feelings are correct or not. You don't have anybody to check in with to make sure that the things that you're doing on a weekly basis are correct. And worst of all, as you continue to exist in this confusing fog, you're spending time and money and you're probably questioning the value that you're getting out of that time and money. And if you're questioning that value, well, then chances are you're probably not getting the value that you're hoping for. But luckily for you, my team and I have developed the course that will help you. The Four Pillars of Singing online course. Discover how to build your own customized training routines. Learn how to make every note start correctly. How to make every note count with our specialized onsets. And that means you're gonna understand a little bit about the phonetics of singing. How certain consonants and certain vowels in your singing can be used to isolate the musculature inside your voice when you're working out and to troubleshoot problems. How to organize and make sense out of the acoustics of singing, resonance, formance, and singing vowels. Learn how to configure your larynx into a singing position called vocal cry mode. This is the same physical configuration that babies use to scream super high and loud without hurting themselves. When we take this configuration called vocal cry mode and apply it towards singing, it will blow down the doors and amaze you. Learn about integrated training routines or ITRs, which is our method for showing you how to build your own customized vocal training routines. Understand which onset and vowel combinations are used to build coordination and tuning or resistance training, which means strength and stability in the head voice. Learn the four most effective and best practice vocal warm-up routines and techniques used in the best vocal studios in the world. Learn a set of onset and siren routines that are used for bridging and connecting that will help you build immediately advanced motor skills and strength for your singing. Learn how to use our unique workflow guides and troubleshooter table, which is gonna help you to go deeper on learning how to troubleshoot your problems and coach yourself. Learn about our deliberate practicing methods which is a way to get the most efficiency out of your practicing, in particular, when you're working on difficult parts in your songs. And most of all, learn how to take your newfound knowledge, 
your skills, motor skills and strength, and learn how to apply them towards your singing so that you can now experience new growth and new levels of artistry when you sing. Hi, my name is Robert Lunty. And by now you might be wondering how my team and I can actually make these claims. Well, here's how and why I can make these claims. These solutions and techniques are not something I just made up. These are time tested and proven techniques that have been used for hundreds of years. And the science that's in this program is current and cutting edge. It's my job to take the time tested solutions and the science and bring it together, sort of turn it around in a way that is easier for the average guy to grasp. That's my job as a voice coach. I've probably helped over a million singers worldwide in over 155 countries. I've done over 65 public master classes on these techniques, have over 26 certified teachers around the world and have over 1,500 five-star reviews. It's working. If it wasn't, my teachers, investors, and students wouldn't be here to help us to get this message out to all of you. I am a member of the National Association of Teachers of Singing and the Voice Foundation, where I have spoken at the symposium in Philadelphia. This is a prestigious platform for only the most vetted teachers in the world. You don't speak and teach there if you don't know what you're doing. I've been doing this for over 15 years. I have a best-selling book and a best-selling course, but don't take my word for it. Take a look at the proof. Take a look at these testimonials. You know, again, just the reason that I chose this method was its, uh, was its technical precision. So for me to, to now learn, oh, okay, there's a, I mean, to geek out on it, right? There's a neuromuscular connection that I need to make with a different part of my voice that I'm used to, which can be really hard because I'm used to doing things in a certain way, but it's been fascinating and really empowering. During the course, we also learned a little bit about uh, performance. So what's, what's the good way to connect with the audience? The changes have been stunning to me and stunning to a lot of my friends and family that I've shown it to as, as well. Robert's methodology really focuses on the technical aspects. I'm a scientist, so I really appreciate that. But it's not just the nuts and bolts, but still understanding some of those nuts and bolts is really, really critical. Take a look at these student performances. It's not a cry that you hear the night It's not somebody who see the light It's a cold and it's a broken Hallelujah 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 Future historians wonder how Eliza reacted when you broke her heart. You have torn it all apart. I'm watching it burn. Watching it burn. The world has no right to my heart. The world has no place in our bed. They don't.
Take a look at what these TVS voice coaches have to say about the program. What I found was the most comprehensive and extensive course I had ever seen. It's almost overwhelming at first, but you know, Robert was really hands-on when I signed up, making sure that I wasn't overwhelmed, making sure I knew what to focus on that would help me get to my goals the fastest. When I first started singing four years ago, I had a lot of problems. My voice was breaking, it was hurting, I lost my voice after concerts and everything. And the voice coaches I went to couldn't really help me, unfortunately. So I started making some researches on internet and I finally found a video on YouTube with Robert Lanty explaining how to build in your head voice. And it was really a game changer for me. So these guys have got the goods. They've been telling me about their uh, methods and the, the way that they're going to be teaching. And I think it's uh, something that I would urge anyone that's serious about singing to look into. Because I think it's going to be uh, a really, really cutting edge uh, kind of system and kind of uh, teaching and education for anyone that wants to sing, you know, from a Friday night in a bar to the stages of the world. Technology in the last five years has really made it possible to deliver this training method and methodology. The same principles that have been developed by the world's leading voice research professionals and authorities are now available to singers. This methodology has taken the complexities and made it easier. Here's exactly what you get from the Four Pillars of Singing online course. The world's leading warm-up programs taught in the world's leading vocal training studios. The five most commonly used onsets that we see in our lyrics that will help you to map your singing. But in this program, you'll learn about what we call acoustic modes, which helps you to make sense of vocal resonance and vowel modification in a way that is easy to grasp and understand for the first time. One thing that's unique about this methodology is we've developed what we call training workflow guides. Now, training workflows are just learning to do the training and learn the techniques with step-by-step -step instructions, sequential steps to learn a process. We developed a troubleshoot table, which will allow you to quickly reference and look up your vocal challenge and problem, and then, then look for a solution that's already been figured out for that particular problem. It could be onsets, vowels, or an integrated train routine. The table will save you time and step-by-step -step instructions that show you how to build your own customized vocal training routines to fix your own issues. We call them Integrated Training Routines, or ITRs. And lifetime access to this course. Once you get in, it's yours to use forever. 